Welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of health and fitness. Today, we have an intriguing topic for you, what happens to your body when you plank for 5 minutes every day? Planking has gained popularity as an effective exercise for core strength and stability. But did you know that it offers numerous benefits beyond that? Join us as we dive into the incredible impact planking can have on your body and overall well-being. Plank will strengthen your muscles. Let's kick off our discussion by exploring how planking can strengthen your muscles. When you engage in a plank position, you activate several muscle groups simultaneously, including your abdominals, back, shoulders, and glutes. Holding this position for an extended period challenges these muscles, leading to increased strength and endurance over time. Plank will develop your back muscles. Another remarkable benefit of planking is its ability to develop your back muscles. As you maintain the plank position, your deep core muscles work in harmony with your back muscles to provide stability. This can help alleviate back pain and promote a healthy spine, making planking an excellent exercise for those with sedentary lifestyles or desk jobs. Plank will fix your posture. Posture plays a crucial role in our overall well-being, and planking can contribute to improving it. By strengthening your core muscles, planking helps support your spine and encourages proper alignment. Regular planking can assist in correcting postural imbalances, such as rounded shoulders or excessive curvature of the spine, leading to better posture and reduced risk of related issues. Plank will boost your metabolism. Did you know that planking can also give your metabolism a significant boost? Planks engage large muscle groups, which require energy even during rest. By incorporating planking into your daily routine, you can increase your metabolic rate and promote fat burning. This makes planking a valuable addition to any weight loss or fitness program. Plank will improve your balance and coordination. In addition to strengthening your core, planking can enhance your balance and coordination. When you perform a plank, you engage your deep stabilizer muscles, which play a vital role in maintaining balance. As you progress and challenge yourself with variations, such as side planks or planks with leg lifts, you'll notice improved stability and coordination in your everyday movements. How long should you hold a plank? Now that we've explored the benefits of planking, you may wonder how long you should hold a plank to reap these rewards. The ideal duration for holding a plank depends on your fitness level. Beginners may start with shorter durations, such as 20-30 seconds, gradually increasing the time as they build strength and endurance. More advanced individuals can aim for 1-2 minutes or even longer, challenging themselves to achieve greater results. Plank Pros and Cons like any exercise, planking has its pros and cons. Let's take a moment to discuss both sides. Pros, planking requires no equipment, making it a convenient exercise that can be done anywhere. It engages multiple muscle groups simultaneously, saving time while providing a comprehensive workout. Planking also promotes better posture, core strength, and stability. Cons, while planking offers numerous benefits, it may not be suitable for everyone. Individuals with wrist, shoulder, or lower back injuries should exercise caution and consult with a healthcare professional. Additionally, overdoing planks or performing them with incorrect form may lead to strain or discomfort. It's crucial to listen to your body and make modifications as needed. Plank Technique now, let's discuss proper plank technique to ensure you maximize the benefits while minimizing the risks. Start by positioning yourself face down with your forearms on the ground and elbows directly under your shoulders. Engage your core muscles, squeeze your glutes, and straighten your legs, resting on your toes. Maintain a straight line from your head to your heels, avoiding sagging or lifting your hips too high. Breathe deeply and evenly throughout the exercise, focusing on maintaining proper form. Nuances of Plank Technique While the basic plank technique we just discussed is effective, there are nuances you can explore to add variety and challenge to your planking routine. Side Plank, shift your weight onto one arm, stacking your feet on top of each other or placing one in front of the other. 
This variation targets your obliques and challenges your balance. Plank with leg lifts, while in the plank position, lift one leg off the ground, keeping it straight. Alternate between legs to engage your glutes and challenge your stability. Dynamic plank, add movement to your plank routine by performing exercises like plank jacks or mountain climbers. These dynamic variations increase the intensity and provide a cardiovascular component. Plank pose contraindications. Before concluding our video, let's touch upon some contraindications for the plank pose. While planking is generally safe for most people, certain conditions or injuries may require modifications or avoidance of this exercise. If you have any of the following conditions, consult with a healthcare professional before incorporating planks into your routine. Wrist or shoulder injuries. Lower back pain or instability. Diastasis recti, abdominal separation post-pregnancy. High blood pressure or heart conditions. That brings us to the end of our video on the incredible effects of planking on your body. Remember, consistency is key when it comes to achieving and maintaining results. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.